Hello and welcome to Try New Food. Today we're going to be making fish curry in tomato sauce. This is a really simple recipe. It goes really good with bread or rice. So, you'll need two pounds of fish. You can use any type of fish that you want. Two teaspoons of oil. I like using coconut oil. Quarter teaspoon of fenugreek seeds. Half an onion, thinly sliced half a teaspoon of each ginger and garlic crushed, approximately one teaspoon of red chili powder. If you like it hot, put a bit more. Quarter teaspoon of turmeric powder, half teaspoon fennel seeds powder, a small piece of dried tamarind. Soak this piece of tamarind in boiling water for a while and squeeze it to get the juice needed for this recipe. A small can of tomato sauce, if you can't get the sauce, take six tomatoes and put them in the microwave. Peel the skin off and put them in the blender. A couple of curry leaves and salt to taste. Now let's start the preparation. Heat the oil and add the fenugreek seeds. Wait until they turn brown. Add the onion. Stir them until they get soft. Once it's soft, add the ginger and garlic. Stir well for one or two minutes. Add both the red chili powder and the turmeric powder. Stir well. Saute until it's mixed in. Add the tamarind juice and let it boil. Then add the fenugreek seeds. Add the tomato sauce and about one cup of water. Add salt. If your tomato sauce is unsalted, put more than usual. But if it is salted, don't put that much. This is something I mess up with a lot. When it starts boiling, cover it with a lid. Cook it for about 10 minutes on a low flame. Then add the fish and curry leaves. I'm sorry, but the day I made this, I sort of ran out of curry leaves. I live about 30 minutes away from the store, and I'm a bit too lazy to go there. Cover it again and cook for another 10 minutes. At around five minutes, Gently stir the fish around. You have to be really gentle, otherwise the fish is gonna fall apart. Or you could do it the way I do it. Just be careful not to spill it or burn yourself. And look, our fish curry is done. I hope you enjoyed the video and please post your comments.